Hi, I'm Bruce, creator of Dad's Castle Greeting Cards, and today I'm going to show you how I convert grease pencil objects into low poly curves. Because often blender projects or node trees begin with a curve. And, uh, well, I just got tired of trying to manipulate the curves to make them look like the way I wanted them to. It's uh, so much easier to just draw them. So, here we go. Okay, I've opened up Blender, the default cube. And let's click on Add or Shift A. We'll add a grease pencil blank. All right. Then let's go from object mode to draw mode. I'm going to select the, from the pencil, I'm going to select the F pen just because it's a little easier for you to see. And then instead of origin up here at the top, we'll select surface. Because so I'll pretend that this is some surface we're going to wrap our curve around and maybe a geometry node tree later. So we're just going to scribble a little bit here. And if that was a curve we want, that'd be really hard to make with just handles and bezier curves. All right. Next, we will come up here and go to the sculpt mode from the draw mode. Because we want to smooth this out a little bit. And I've used other methods to smooth it, but this seems to work the best. Just a quick get some of those wiggles gone. We'll change the shape of our curve a little bit. But the, the main shape is still there. Just wrap that around. Okay. Then we're going to go from the sculpt mode to the edit mode. I'm going to select here the uh, stroke. So I can select the entire stroke at once. And then we'll go to the uh, stroke button up here. Simplify. Fixed. And then we'll go back to object mode. And we have our, our whole curve there, our whole grease pencil selected, the object. And then we'll go from object mode here to convert to Bezier curve. All right. Now, if you look over here, you notice that it created the Bezier curve layer, but we're still on grease pencil. So I'm going to hide the grease pencil and then select our curve. And this is one we want to make a little simpler with some handles. So from here, we'll click edit mode, then curve, go down to clean up, then decimate curve, go down to our lower left, put that arrow, now we can just decimate it down to wherever we need it to be. Let's go a little further, get as simple as we can, and keep the same basic shape of the curve. Maybe somewhere, whoops, a little too much. Let's go back up again. Probably right in there is probably good. Okay. So now we have just a few points with some control points. So if we still need to make some fine tuning, you know, we can we can still do that and make some adjustments. But this gets us pretty close to the curve we started with. And it's a lot uh, simpler than adjusting it from scratch. Well, there you have it. Let me know if you liked the video, any comments below, and uh, have a great day.